Bula Binaka and a very good morning to you all. I'm uh, delighted this morning to be once again be in the West. And I've uh, seen a lot of uh, old faces, but there are also some uh, new faces. But uh, today I'm delighted to be with you to celebrate the anniversary of our independence, Fiji Day 2016. Ladies and gentlemen, all across our nation, Fijians are coming together. Fijians are coming together to remember our proud history and strengthen the bond between our people. In every division, festivities like this one are taking place. Our banner of Fiji is blue, and I thank you for wearing blue today. The Fiji has stood as an independent nation. 46 years that we have been responsible for forging our own destiny in the world. This year's theme, moving all Fijians forward in unity, is the same mantra that has been driven Fiji progress since the Baini Marama and Fiji First Government. It is based in the belief that we are stronger when we work together and when we find ways to involve all our people in our economic progress and advancement. We are strongest when we celebrate our shared identity as Fijians, equal under the law and equally committed to moving, moving our nation forward. That same theme is also deeply ingrained in our Bill of Rights in the 2013 Constitution. They are the basic protections that level that level the playing fields for our people are enshrined for all times. And that is very much worth celebrating as a major milestone in our history. In our history. Ladies and gentlemen, in the new Fiji, every member of our society is part of the journey forward that includes those of us who reside in isolated rural and maritime areas. And those who are most vulnerable, the women, the children, the elderly, and infirm, the disabled. No matter who you are, no matter where you call home, you deserve to be involved in our success and have access to the same essential services as anyone else. So ladies and gentlemen, all of us can raise our flags proudly and know with complete certainty that this nation, this government belongs to each, each one of us. Ladies and gentlemen, the strength of the Fijian people has proudly, has undoubtedly been tested over the past year. But at the same time, the, the spirit of camaraderie and unity that we can celebrate today also carried us through those trying times. When uh, tropical cyclone Winston ravaged our nation, causing mass destruction, taking lives and leaving many of our people on their knees, we came together. Like never before, to care for those who are affected and rebuild the livelihoods that were lost. That work, ladies and gentlemen, is still ongoing. And the resilient character of our people will help us reclaim what was taken and emerge as an even stronger nation. Ladies and gentlemen, in the midst of this strategy, we, all, we also experienced triumph when the, the Rugby Sevens team took Rio by storm and won our first ever Olympic gold medal. Watching our boys sweep the competition aside and taking their rightful place as Olympic champions was one of the most exciting moments in Fiji's history and something none of us will never forget. It was a strong statement to the world of Fiji's ambition and our ability. It was a statement of all small island states that our, that our small size is no limit to finding success on the world stage. Ladies and gentlemen, there is no doubt that the optimism that victory gave us 
has carried us through these past months and it will continue to inspire us in our collective effort to uplift our nation. Ladies and gentlemen, so truly, whether facing challenges or re revealing history, this past year has shown that there has been a time when we can, we can be more proud to call ourselves Fijians. Today, we can celebrate. We give respect to those who have come before us, those who helped build, build this nation. And we look to the future, hopeful and confident of what we can achieve, what we can together achieve. Ladies and gentlemen, we now will able to thank you and may God bless us all and may God bless Fiji.